Hey guys, last video of the month. Got the FIA number drilled into your head? You started budgeting? Have you done your dream board? Are you inspired by it? If you're not inspired by it, do it again. You need to be inspired by that dream board in order to keep your energy high and stay positive with this because it is a tough mission. Today, we're gonna talk about family and health goals. There's no sense, guys, being rich or retired and having no one to share with no loved ones or be sick and dying. You gotta take care of yourself and have loved ones around you in order for this to be a fulfilling mission for you. We're gonna start with health. Health is something I took for granted for a long time in my 20s. I thought I was invincible. I thought I was gonna live forever. I could eat anything I wanted to in my 20s and still look like a rock star. It's a little bit different now in my 30s. I'm a big believer now that you gotta exercise your body before you exercise your mind. I'll tell you a story. When I was in my 20s, I used to tell my friends that I didn't get hangovers. The reality was, I would wake up in the morning and feel terrible. But what I would force myself to do is get up and do a 45 minute grueling workout after a big night of partying because I knew I had a lot to focus on that day. And that was something that inspired me and motivated me to make sure I was still having fun but I was still taking care of my body to make sure I could function the next day. Now, I'm not gonna tout myself as a health guru because I'm not, but what I do know is that in order to keep your energy up, you gotta fill your body with high octane gas. This means eating right, partying on occasion, and exercising regularly. How you choose to do it is up to you, but just make sure you do it. That is what's gonna give you the energy to keep going on this mission. You need high energy in order to fulfill this mission. You must give your body lots of healthy nutrients and exercise. As you're gonna learn in a future video when it comes down to time management, there's 168 hours in a week. And if you're only working 40 of them, it's not enough to achieve what we're trying to do here. Your body's gonna be pushed and you're gonna be working on your goals 60 to 80 hours in a week. That's how you condense this mission. I wish I could say there's a secret sauce, but there's not. That's why we're talking about health and making sure that you keep it up and at a good state. Accountability assignment. I want you to go to the Mission 35 website and download the health goals form. I want you to send it in. On that form, there's three things I want you to send in to us that you're committed to doing to improve your health, which will in turn improve your energy over the next six months. Three things, that's it. The three things can be anything. It could be how you're gonna eat better, something you're gonna cut out of your diet, exercising more, quitting smoking, whatever it's gonna be, put it into us and we're gonna keep you accountable to it. Remember, going for a run or exercising is way better than sitting in front of the computer. If you're gonna binge watch something on Netflix, do it on a treadmill. Family goals, it's the last one we're gonna talk about. That's something that's near and dear to my heart. My dad passed away. I had an enormous amount of guilt by not spending enough time with him by his bedside when I was busy padding my pocketbook. And that's time that I'll never get back. By planning for this in your goals, it will give you a fuller, richer life. Spending time with family and friends, laughing, making memories, that was one of my dad's biggest things, will actually give you energy as opposed to those times when you go home and say, I just want to be left alone. Spend some time with people. It's proven that by being with people, it elevates your energy as opposed to depletes it. Here's your accountability for family. Go to the Mission 35 member site, download the family goal. This is what I want you to do for your family goals. I want you to fill out the time and send it to us at Mission 35 that you're going to be spending with those family and friends. It's important that you keep yourself accountable to that time slot. There is no other appointment that's more important than spending that time with family. Your goals are gonna be ever changing and that's okay. Make sure that you are goal setting in a positive frame of mind, like on vacation, Christmas holidays, not 10 o'clock at night after the kids have gone to bed and you had a terrible day at work and you were fighting with your partner. The better state of mind you are in, the better your goals are gonna turn out essentially the better your life is gonna turn out. It's important to keep your forget it all number, that FIA in the forefront of your mind. That number is what you're shooting for. That number is what's motivating you in order to make these tough choices. Keep trying to reduce the necessities. Keep trying to increase your investments. 
that's gonna grow that number exponentially as we go on in this lesson. This will be easy to do the more money that you make, which we're gonna teach you about in future lessons. Guys, you're armed and ready now to actually tackle the quiz. If you've watched all the videos, you sunk your teeth into this, you've listened to the two podcasts, you'll be ready to take the quiz when the time comes. Do the work, stay positive, keep your energy high, and make this a fabulous day.